Hey guys, welcome back to my channel and welcome officially to the Vlogmas season where there will hopefully be videos every single day up to Christmas. So definitely like this video if you are excited and we are starting episode one with me setting the scene for this Vlogmas season, going into London and a taste test, well actually two of them, so I really hope you guys enjoy hey, it. Hey milk up, milk up, calm down, calm down. <gasps> oh, oh, no, 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 don't bite me, don't bite me. <laughs> okay, so we are starting off well we're being bitten by a cat hey guys it is december the first happy vlogmas oh my gosh i actually can't believe it's december like genuinely where does time go like it felt like january yesterday milka is sat on my chair she's taking up all of the chair i'm like perched on the edge if you've watched any of my like christmas videos before you'll know that like mom normally makes us advents every year um she told me this morning that she's not doing it every day this year but i do actually have an advent calendar i was sent this one from hip and yeah we're gonna start opening number one today it's plastic free and it has um plain salted caramel gingerbread and white chocolate um in the advent calendar i am so excited oh my god did i break it i'm sorry i will never like not get excited about opening advent oh my god christmas trivia the UK's Brussels sprout industry is worth 650 million pounds. Jesus, I'm sure I contribute about 50%. I love Brussels sprouts. Come on. Thank you, Hip, for like blessing me this Christmas. But yeah, today is the first, obviously. Oh, it's cold. Sorry, I'm being distracted. And yeah, I apologize that my videos have been a bit confusing lately. As in, yes, I am starting Vlogmas officially late. Um, just because I had three more Switzerland vlogs to post. Anyway. Cheers to the chocolate. Mmm. Oh, that tastes so good. Wow. Mmm. 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 Just a bit of water. I've kind of been getting in the Christmassy spirit today. I mean, I haven't listened to any Christmas music yet. Um, but I have been making some cards with my Cricut machine and then I was wrapping presents for some friends because I'm going to see Mia, who I was with in Switzerland, um, today in London because she's visiting family. So I am going into London and I'll bring you guys along with me. In the spirit of Vlogmas, I will vlog today. But I did just kind of like want to set the scene for vlogmas this year because obviously last year like i very much branded it as vlogmas like i had day one day two etc and it was like themed around christmas stuff and obviously there will be christmas content of course i was thinking about what i could do this year to like make it a bit different and the theme is going to be like working on ourselves growth you know implementing changes setting new goals routines like just trying to be a better version of ourselves before the new year because i feel like why are we waiting for like 2023 to appear for us to then start setting goals and like implementing changes or like writing down what we want to do that year why don't we just like start now i've recently been like in a bit of a slump which i'm gonna talk about obviously in these videos but i've very recently come out of that and i'm feeling really really good but i just want to keep you know taking that further i'm going to be talking about different topics every day or doing different things every day to ultimately work on myself before the new year so that when i get to 2023 like i am ready i am already set and i'm on a roll that my friends is what we're doing this vlogmas i don't know i feel like that will be fun and there'll be like a continuous theme running through the videos so yeah if you have any ideas if you want to see me do anything in particular in the vlogs or talk about anything um definitely let me know down below like leave it in the comment section or you can like send me a dm on instagram so cheers to the start of december and to whatever we're gonna get up to this month and as i said we're gonna be the best versions of ourselves going into the new year like that's gonna be so good can i close my eyes and pick one this is advent day one <laughs> Yeah, I've explained to the vlog that we're doing 1, 5, 10, 15, 20, 25. Yeah, it's a bit odd. No, we're not 25, that's oh. Christmas Day. I don't know why I'm closing my eyes. Oh, um, I'll put uh, into which one you want. I want your... Oh, this hand. Oh, I'll just take it. Thank you. I don't think it's a mug. Yeah. <laughs> oh, it looks like a chunky mug. Very expensive. Oh, don't look at the box of the hard Christmas. Oh, is it a Christmassy one? <gasps> oh, hello. Taking forever. I know, but you might want to reuse the foil. <gasps> it's a mug with something inside. <gasps> it's red. Oh, it's very nice. It feels nice. It feels funny, doesn't it? Do you think it's red? It feels 
the bottom so I left the uh, thing on prior to price. Mm. Ooh, <laughs> did it work? My favourite. Oh, very nice. Thank you, Mum. And inside, what are these? <gasps> Sweet. It's Kevin the carrot. Is a really thick that can you have them? Oh, obviously they're vegan, Mum. Very Christmassy, obviously. In a Christmas no. mug. That was the one I thought I'd give you. Oh, but really? I didn't know which one to because I think Emily might like the other one better. Oh really? It feels like a scarf. Like it's got like it the feels knitted like really. there's a print on it. I know I was in the yeah. shop thinking, oh I wonder if that's a good feel or not. It's strange, but it's quite cool. Do you want to see Matthew's yes. mug? Oh yeah, what are you making like? Oh, that's quite cool. Do you like that one better? <laughs> no, I like my one better, but Matthew on, will like that. Well, he does back. like that, I'm on the back. Oh yeah. Mandy's Reindeer. Got, Mandy's got a vegan carrot. Mmm. Right. Anyway, I'm off to London. <laughs> So I didn't spend the whole day in London obviously I was going in quite late in the day actually but I was just so excited to see Mia even though I'd seen her really recently in Switzerland and you know it was a nice excuse to see all of the Christmas lights on the first day of December officially. I'm in King's Cross which is where I was literally like a week ago coming in from um, Switzerland via Paris. Well it would have been the last video. Um, lost in Paris basically. Um, but yeah it is very Christmassy. We have Christmas lights everywhere. I'm just waiting for Mia. I'm like basically at arrivals at St Pancras. Did I say King's Cross? Yes. This is St Pancras. It's like dark already. It's not even that late. It's like half four. Um, it feels like 7 p.m. I might actually go to Greg's because I have like the free thing on my phone where you download the app and you get a free bake and a hot drink. So that's what I might do. And I mean, it's kind of offensive. Excuse me. That's a bit noisy. I've been vegan since 2016, but I've never had the vegan sausage roll from Greg's. Like, that is kind of offensive, so I might try and get that today using the free thing on my app. But they do have a festive bake as well. I'm just not sure whether to try that. I looked at the Christmas one. It doesn't sound too appealing to me, but I'll keep you guys updated. I really want to surprise Mia because she surprised me when I arrived in Switzerland, so I want to do the same. This can't go wrong, right? Um... I mean, it's me we're talking about, but there's also a pianist, which is quite nice. Definitely at the right place. Definitely. <gasps> Where is she? I see it. I see it. I see it. <laughs> <laughs> it's the thing we haven't seen each other in ages. <laughs> so my surprise did go to plan, and then we just caught up in a coffee shop, got some hot drinks, and then looked around this market, which is right outside King's Cross Station. As I said you guys this first episode of vlogmas has two taste tests in it both of them are from greg's there's gonna be lots of announcements but i'm gonna try and do a taste test in the middle of king's cross station we have the goods this is the vegan bake i was gonna get the sausage roll as i said but i was like it's vlogmas it's christmas season i need to try this which is limited edition obviously for christmas i didn't get a drink because they didn't have vegan milk um and it was a bit confusing because she said I needed to top up but like you can definitely get a free bake and a drink without having anything on the app I'm not usually a fan of savoury pastry things I don't even know what's inside it it's not very hot but I'm not really a fan of things being super hot because it burns my mouth it's interesting I don't really get the Christmas vibe. I was expecting there to be cranberries in it, but I don't see cranberries or taste cranberries. So apparently this vegan festive bake has corn pieces in it, sage and onion stuffing, vegan bacon, and then cranberry and sage sauce, apparently. Um, okay. I have pastry everywhere. I just got down to a bit of cranberry and had a tiny taste of Christmas, but it's not amazing at all. I don't actually think I've ever been to Greg's before, which is also quite shocking i mean i didn't pay anything for it so you know i'd rate it maybe like a five out of ten definitely not up there but i don't know if i can actually get something else on the app because she didn't like change it or like say i use the promo code i'm not really sure so i can maybe go to a different greg's and get the sausage roll imagine i could technically come and do it again or i could go to a different one now hmm. <gasps> I just got the vegan sausage roll. They're supposed to scan a QR code and that turns off the voucher thing, but 
I'm in the Greggs. The lady in the other Greggs in King's Cross didn't know what she was doing, so I didn't turn off the coat, so I got another one. And I got a green tea because basically Greggs don't do alternative milk, so I'm really shocked that they don't do alternative milk. But this is a green tea, so I got my hot drink. And I'm gonna try this, because I've never had the sausage roll. Mm, it actually looks nice. had a sausage roll in absolutely years. Um, that's nice. Mm. Mm, I'm so hungry. I give this an 8 out of 10. Yeah. Seven and a half, eight out of ten. And yeah, I would definitely recommend the vegan sausage roll. As you can tell, I clearly enjoyed it more than the bake. Whoa, that's gonna be way too hot. But yeah, two in one day. That is impressive. Definitely prefer the sausage roll, the vegan bake. I wasn't that much of a fan of it. I have pastry everywhere again. This is all of my mess. Um, I'm gonna get the tube now and like head home, work on the train and drink my green tea. Trying to carry around this hot drink whilst I was making my way back home on the trains and tubes was not a great idea, but as I said, I did some work on my phone on the train and yeah, eventually got back home. My cheeks are so red. I just walked back from the station. It was cold and now I'm inside. What is that on my bed? Some food. I burnt my tongue on the green tea. I knew I was gonna burn my tongue because it was so hot. And when you sip out of that tiny hole in those cups, it's just like, oh, it's just not great. It burnt my tongue and I was like, no, Holly, why did you just wait? And um, yeah, I actually had two pairs of socks on today. Not that you can see them. In Switzerland, I wore my Converse pretty much every day when I was exploring and they did start to give me blisters. I think because I um, wasn't wearing thick enough socks or I wasn't wearing two socks, but Today I put two socks on and it actually worked. They didn't rub and my feet were very, very warm. I'm gonna try Kevin's carrot sweets. I just told mom about the free Greg's app and she is on it already. I have scissors. I know that's a bit extreme, but <gasps> they're so cute. I think it's from, yes, Aldi. Aldi always actually brings out such good vegan stuff. Uh, Mmm. Yes, you guys, they are good. But yeah, I'm gonna do some work now at my desk. This technically, well, I don't know yet, but as I've been talking about and I'm dropping hints here and there, like next year, big things are happening. Like a lot is gonna change in my life and I'm so excited for this new chapter. I will be sharing a bit in December and then everything and all the updates will come in like January next year. Everything is kind of unknown but I do have plans and it very much just depends on what happens but you know it could be like my last Christmas period spent in the UK for a while and so I just want to enjoy myself. I want to obviously spend time with my family, my friends. I do love Christmas. It is such a good time to celebrate and just remind yourself um why it is great to be alive that is so deep okay and i didn't expect to go that deep in episode one of vlogmas but as i said we're gonna excuse me but yeah as i said we're gonna be talking about a lot in this christmas period for vlogmas but yeah it's just very crazy and cool to think that next year like a lot is gonna happen but yeah that is just a little update from me and yeah that is where i am officially going to conclude episode one of the vlogmas series as i said at the start of the video definitely comment down below if you have any ideas or suggestions if you want to see me do anything or try anything speak about anything in particular then just let me know and yeah definitely like this video if you enjoyed it as usual subscribe hit the bell so you know when i upload which will be every day at the moment and yeah i will speak to you a very soon in another video. Obviously, I'm gonna leave you guys with the bloopers. So, so good. Wow. Wow, Milka, wow. It was really sunny before and now it's not that sunny anymore. Uh, my MacBook is making me look orange, so let's close that. Milka, do you really wanna like not take up the whole chair? Joe, you're not putting that on camera so that I'll have it in the are you? Emily won't see this. I'm not that fast at uploading the videos. Oh, that sounded very weird. But anyway, um... Min Min! And then day one was successful! I keep getting really confused with time and the years at the moment. Um, yeah, we're in 22. We're December the 1st, Holly. Let's get it in the brain. Yeah, what was I gonna say? I was gonna say something, but now I can't remember what I was gonna say. There's so many people getting off this train. 
Well, I mean, it's the Euro stop. Like, I'm literally covered in pastry. Okay, thank you, Greg's. It was okay. Whoa, that is messy. I'm just gonna move it so you can't see it in the video. Come on, Karen. I can't open it. I can't open it. I can't open my carrots. I didn't want a carrot. This hair is just so frizzy. Milka. Mini. Get your little butt cheek off my MacBook.